How to keep food warm for a party. 7 ways. If you're hosting a party and want to serve up a warm meal or some warm snacks you want to work out how to keep them warm for everyone to enjoy. You don't want to have your food get cold before your guests are able to eat it. Luckily, there are a lot of different ways that you can keep food warm for a party, with or without electricity. But how exactly do you keep food warm for a party? What are the best techniques to use and what do I recommend? There are lots of different methods for keeping hot food hot and even great ways put food on display while still keep it hot for your guests to enoji. Depending on what kind of food you're serving, what kind of part you're having, how you want to display it and what tools you have available to you then. One or more of the methods below might suit you. 1. Use aluminum foil and towels. One of the simplest and easiest ways to keep food hot at a party is to place the food in a container and wrap it in aluminum foil and then wrap it in a towel. The container and aluminum foil traps steam, which helps to reduce heat loss, but it's also great at reflecting as radiation. This was a trap heat in your food for longer. Use multiple layers of aluminum foil to get extra insulation. Wrapping your food in a towel also protects it from heat loss due to conduction. Use 1-2 to two towels to completely wrap your food and this will keep it hotter longer than if you don't use any towels at all. You can use aluminum foil or towels separately but using it combined tends to get the best results. When it comes time to serve your food simply take your food out of the towel and foil and serve quickly. 2. Use a cooler. Well coolers are usually used to keep things cold the insulation in the coolers can actually be used to trap heat inside a cooler keeping your food hot. When your cooler is full of hot food the insulation stops the heat escaping. And so your food stays hot for longer. I would still recommend you wrap your food in aluminum foil and maybe even consider adding some hot water bottles or hot bricks to your cooler to keep your food even hotter, but we'll talk more about those in a bit. Also it's a good idea to get rid of any empty air space in your cooler and this will cool down your food. Fill this empty space with towels. You do need to be careful not to melt the plastic in your cooler. When it comes time to serve your food get it out of the cooler and your guests will be enjoying a hot meal. 3. Keep in the oven on low. If your party is happening inside and you have access to an oven then placing that oven on low and leaving your food inside can be a great way to keep it warm. You want to make sure that your oven is set to 140 degrees Fahrenheit, 60 degrees Celsius, or higher as this will stop any bacteria growth from happening. And you can leave the food in there safely for hours at a time. It's also a good idea to put some aluminum foil over the top of your food while it sits in the oven. This will stop moisture escaping and your food drying out. If you don't have access to an oven or electricity don't worry there are lots of ways to keep food hot without electricity. 4. Chafing dishes. Chafing dishes are a great way to keep food warm at a party because they can be used to actively heat the food even without electricity. They are usually made from stainless steel pans that you put your food in. The food then sits on top of another stainless steel pan that is filled shallowly with hot water. You then use chafing fuel containers which are lit underneath and the fire keeps the water hot which in turn keeps your food hot without burning it or overcooking it. Chafing fuel containers usually last around 6 hours or more which is generally more than enough time to keep your food warm at a party. Chafing dishes don't have to be expensive either. They start as low as $30 $50 and the chafing fuel canisters are also extremely affordable. 5. Use a slow cooker. Slow cookers are designed to use a low level of heat to either cook food or to keep it warm for an extended period of time. Slow cookers will keep your food hot without drying it out as the lid is designed to trap in most moisture. Slow cookers will also keep your food above 140 degrees Fahrenheit, 60 degrees Celsius, which is the safe zone where your bacteria is unable to grow. So you can leave your party food in a slow cooker for hours at a time without having to worry about it going off. 6. Store food in a thermal cooker. A thermal cooker is usually designed to slow cook meals without any electricity but it can also be used to keep food hot on the go. It works in the same way as a thermos, using vacuum insulation to trap heat inside keeping your food hot. The benefit of a thermal cooker over a thermos is they are so much larger. So you can store full meals in there. Plus the extra thermal mass of larger meals means they can stay hot for hours and hours at a time. If food is starting out around boiling temperature then a thermal cooker can keep it hot for up to 8 hours or even longer. 7. Use the grill slash barbecue. If you're having a backyard party and you want to keep some food hot you may want to consider using your grill slash barbecue. 
Place your dishes inside the barbecue in foil trays or oven-proof containers and turn on one of the side burners on low and close the lid of your grill. You don't want to have your food directly under the burner as this can overcook it. But the burner will keep the inside of the grill hot much like an oven would and will keep your food hot in the process.